G'day folks and welcome to the round 16 edition of Source on the Sidelines. We're out here at Chipsy Wood Oval for the Triple M match of the round between South and GPS where the Gallopers have got up. We're here with number seven, Tommy Kibble. Tommy, massive win there for the boys, backing up after a really solid win over West as well. Must be proud. Yeah, look, we're really happy with our performance today. We kept to our structures really well and uh, uh, South really tested us out wide really and uh, it was really good performance from the boys, yeah, all credit and it's uh, set us up well for uh, the final run into the uh, into finals, yeah. Now mate, Matty Jaquel's locked down the seven jersey but he's away in South Africa, you filled in that role, how did you find being out in the back row after a few weeks at lock? Yeah, it was really good, he's over having a bit of a party time now so uh, get the opportunity to step up and uh, really enjoying it, getting out of the, uh, the second row where uh, keeping the ears intact which is uh, quite nice but uh, yeah, really enjoying it. Now, Tommy, you're only in your first year out of high school. How have you found the step up to Premier Grade? Yeah, it's uh, been a really big step up, but um, I'm really fortunate at Jeeps to have players like Freddie Burke, uh, Ryan Freeney, Mitch King and Dan Gorman who have really sort of mentored me and helped me my way through and uh, my journey into Premier Grade and it's, uh, I'm really grateful for that and um, they've helped me out a lot, yeah. And obviously you guys were trailing there in the second half and managed to come back and secure that win right there in the dying minutes. Speaks a lot about the belief that the boys have of themselves this year. Yeah, we've just got a lot of really experienced players in our team and they kept uh, stressing that we have cool, calm heads and uh, we go back to our structure and do what we do well and uh, that really worked out for us today. Now this is the start of a massive three week period. You've got Souths, then UQ and then Easts. How big is this, this next fortnight going to be leading into finals? Yeah, it really, uh, it, it's, uh, it's good for us. It tells us where we are within the, the top four, it shows us, and it's a good lead-in to uh, make sure that we're, we're hitting peak performance when it comes to finals time, and we've played these teams before, so we'll have a good idea of what they're going to throw at us when it comes to finals time. So it's a, I think it's, a, it's, a, it's a beneficial for us. The win today, obviously, sees the Bunter Bowl stay at Yoku Road. How good? Yeah, it's pretty good to have the Bunter Bowl at Yoku Road. It's where it's going to stay. All right, well, thanks for that one, Tommy. All right, folks, that's it from out here at Chipsy Wood Oval for round 16 of Queensland Premier Rugby. What an absolute belter of a match. Make sure you keep up to date with all things grassroots rugby via our Facebook page.